السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته سيستا thank you for the motivation I started so far just two days and I have seen a big change الحمد لله ما شاء الله تبارك الله carry on and do not stop السلام عليكم سيستا ورحمة الله ورحمة الله وبركاته I'm so happy I want to share with you my miracles of استغفار and سورة البقرة and تهجد so she's doing استغفار سورة البقرة and تهجد My life has completely changed. People started to recognize me, and um, um, I'm only read Surah Al-Baqarah says five days. I cannot believe my sister. Every day I get new proposal. Thank you, sister. I don't know how to thank you. Once again, we say, guys, you need to. Um, if you have an issue, you can, uh, or even if you don't have an issue, it's good to always be close to Allah. So, but when once you're stuck, um, you don't need to go for drugs or committing suicide or something like that. You can just go for Allah. Go back to Allah. Repent, repent to Him. Do istighfar. Any numbers of istighfar. It's not necessary to stuck to number, specific number. You can just see, leave it countless or open. Also, you can recite Surah Al-Baqarah. If you can recite it daily, it will be great. But if you can't, it's not a big issue. It's not a big deal. Do as much as you can. And you can read it in your language as well. If you can't recite Arabic, it's good to understand. Um, regarding if you can write, read it in, you know, in for, women, for ladies, for women, if in your monthly thing. I don't know about that. Please do your research or ask someone. Um, I rather keep my opinion. Um, if you actually is Islam, if everyone, uh, for you know, for Muslim and non-Muslim, and for black and white, we all equal. And I will I will say that again because some people just start to attack me. Uh, we are all equal according to the Hadith. Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam said, "We all equal." There is no difference between some Arab or the non-Arab. It's just only taqwa. Taqwa is fear of Allah. And you're applying your, what you learn from Islam. It's not about uh, we love uh, the, the white people more than the black. This is rubbish. We do not like that. We are all equal in front of Allah on the Day of Judgment. You, Allah is going to charge us for what we have done. Not because you are white or black. This is rubbish mentality. I'm not going to deal with this kind of mentality, guys. And um, yeah. So if you stuck, just try to do a salatu ala nabi or some people they call it durud. Uh, you can la hawla wa la quwata illa billah. All this, all this stuff is key. Allah give us the key to get out of any kind of issue. And we need to use it because this is a way you can, you know, you can secure your place in heaven and you can just work and to get out from any kind of situation in dunya. So this is what Allah wants us to do. He wants us to be... Like more close to him. The more you be close to Allah, the more you gonna you gonna get out quickly from your stuff. Yes, we have a test. Allah uh, told us from the first day, from the scratch, that I'm gonna test you guys. So we are aware that we have to be tested in in this life in dunya. So we need to be tested. We have to be tested. So we have to accept the test, accept it in a patient way, not in a waiting way. This is a st this is the main point. Do not. It's okay, I'm a patient. I've been reading Surah Al-Baqarah for one month and nothing changed. God, this is not patient. These are, you are waiting, not patient. You are not be patient. You're just waiting for the situation to be changed. I hope you understand that there is a difference between waiting and to be patient. Patient means to accept what Allah gave you and you pray for him to change it. But waiting is okay. I, am ha I have to wait because I have no option to change. This is a big difference. So I hope you understand my message. And I will see you inshallah again. No, it's different message, inshallah. Assalamu alaikum.